Hi everyone, in front of me I've got a ZTE Blade A51 and let me share with you how to add the fingerprint to this device. So let's start with opening the settings and right here we have to scroll to find the security. Let's tap on it. Now let's tap on fingerprint and tap on fingerprint management. As you can see, this is the very first step of adding the fingerprint if you do not have the screen lock. If you've got one, no worries, it will be transferred to the proper step. Mm, if not, you have to do it right now. So let me pick the pattern. Let's draw it. Tap on next. Re redraw it and confirm. It is crucial because if for some reason your device, uh, I mean the fingerprint uh, sensor won't work, then you will still be able to unlock your device. So uh, here you have to decide what kind of notification content you want to show. So just mark the option and tap on done and tap on register. As you can see, we've got this information, what we have to do. So we have to simply put our finger on the sensor, which is located on the um, back of our device. So let me put my finger on it. And right now we have to do it multiple times in order to add our fingerprint fully. So try to catch every corner for a better recognition. And as you can see, it's quite fast in this device. We just successfully added the fingerprint. So confirm it with OK. We've got the fingerprint management. Uh, this is the fingerprint we just added. We can rename it or remove it if you want to. Uh, you can add another fingerprint. And as you can see, you can add up to five different fingerprints. And you can decide what kind of functions uh, the fingerprint will have. So wake up and unlock your phone and simple touch. It's everything up to you. So let me look at the device and let's check if it is working. Let me look it and put my finger on the sensor. Okay. As you can see, uh, I've just um, unlocked the device, which simply means that we successfully added the fingerprint. All right, so that will be all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this video was helpful. And if it was, please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.